Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you how to use a no CD or DVD patch. I know what you guys are wondering, that this is illegal, which is totally not. This is not illegal, but it is illegal up to a certain extent and what you use it for. I have done the research, and yeah, it says right here, it is illegal to use a no CD crack for pirated games, but it is perfectly illegal to use them if you own the game. So there you go. I'm using this on games I bought, like I use one for San Andres and The Sims 3. So that's all I gotta say about this. It is illegal for pirated games. It is legal if you own and bought the game. Um. So yeah, this video's purpose is only for people who bought the game. So if you go in the description, go it will lead you to gameburnworld.com it's a really cool website you should check it out um, if you want to know CD cracks go to where it says channels under home is game fixes go to game fixes and these are just for no CD cracks so let's say I want to get one for the sims 3 so I click on T for the scroll all the way down found the sims 3 so right here it says Sims 3 sensor patch. That's to remove the sensors, I guess, if you want to see their crotches, which is really nasty. Um, the Sims 3 generic no DVD theme patcher. Now these are the versions. Make sure you know what version you have before you do this. Um, and it also says right here related files for this game, trainers and cheats, whatever. Um, let's say I'm just gonna use this one as an example. Download Mirror 1 from North America. Click to download the file. Save file. And let's see what this is about. Whoops. Ah, sorry. Okay, sorry guys. That was a uh, wrong one that I downloaded. So, make sure you accidentally download the generic no DVD patcher. Uh, which is not right. Uh, let's just say I have 1.6.6. That's when I downloaded already and installed. And it works. So I'm going to click download the file. Save the file. Double click on it. Now it's going to have the name of your game. Mine says ts3.exe. It's the name of it, The Sims 3. Now to put it in, you're going to need to patch up the original file so let's go look for it electronic arts the sims 3 game now you gotta look for where the main game is at so mine right here i already have it installed and i have a backup just in case it didn't work but it did just in case it doesn't work always have a, a backup so it'll be really easy to go back to so yeah just drag it drop it in and there you go that's how you use a no CD patch or DVD um, one quick update before I go my one of my videos that I made went popular um, it's the how to use or how to make Windows 7 look like Mac OS X Snow Leopard great great news YouTube put a uh, message for me well they messaged me I guess you want to say um, saying that that video got really popular and they're gonna pay me aka YouTube partnership and I don't even have that many subscribers but I'm getting YouTube partnership for that video so I want to thank all you guys for watching that video and subscribing and yeah uh, I'm really happy right now I'm going partner and with Google Adsense it's also going to help me. They said it'll take one to two business days. I just got it right now. Well, not right now, like three hours ago when I came home from school. I was really excited. And yeah. So that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe like always. See you guys later.